Welcome back to JP Roofing Fan Nation. From the City of Champions to Team USA, Ryan Bugsy Malone is a true hometown hero. Yeah, that's right. He was the first Pittsburgh-born and trained player to put on the pads for the Pens. We met up with Ryan at the Lemieux Fantasy Camp to ask that most vital of Fan Nation questions. Where are Ryan's been? As you know, the, the colors of black and gold were literally on me from when I was born. Ryan was destined for the ice. He not only followed his dad into the NHL, but onto the Pens roster and then the history books. Greg and Ryan Malone became the second father-son duo to score hat tricks for the same team, something he couldn't have predicted back then. And looking back, even at all my pictures in youth hockey, growing up I had like the Penguins gloves on or pants. You always saw the Penguin logo and all my, uh, my gear because I was grabbing whatever extra gear. But we were rollerblading around the Civic Arena, played hide and go seek the ramps, you know, in the yeah. Civic Arena. It was, it was crazy. And I was legit using like Yags and Recky sticks <laughs> growing up, you know, like just from being around the locker rooms and after games, just, you know, being kind of like that rink rat. From a rink rat playing hockey with his idle sticks to playing alongside them on the wing, Ryan's good fortune hasn't been lost on him. It's crazy looking back and realizing how lucky I was to grew up that way and then you know calling Rex a, a teammate and line mate and getting to be able to play with them was you know it's just, just uh, a surreal type thing you always dream about as a kid and uh, you know it, it came true. Now Ryan is using his Steel Town status to give back and make a difference in the 412 helping raise funds for local organizations like the Pittsburgh Warriors a hockey team made up of veterans with service connected disabilities. Uh, kind of my drive uh, moving forward and, and mission is kind of just uh, try to use my, my platform and try to help others here in the city and help uh, spread the love. I think the world needs um, some healing and, and love right now, so any way they can get it with a hockey stick or, or a puck, that would be great. This former bruiser fights other great causes too. He hit the ice for RMU's hockey celebrity game, which led to the restoration of the college's hockey team. You know, that's what it's about, and I'm, I'm happy to uh, give back now, and especially the community that's gave me so much. And I think that's what, you know, fired me up with the, the RMU programs. Everyone's asking me, oh, why are you coming back? You never played there. I'm like, well, I grew up in Pittsburgh, and there was three rinks back in the day. Now we're, we're, we're part of my language. Hockey town. <laughs> <laughs> it's like,